For the love of a press photo. <laughs> So, I have got a Ian up in the show picker, Dick doing the show picker, and the kids trying to get a dead fish out of the moat. I mean, it happens, it's nature. It's nature. Oh. It's nature, is it? The cruel harshness of nature. Yeah. Oh dear. Kids are fishing. Another dead one? Yeah. You're not? No, that's all! That's not dead for you! It, it's a Oh, that's all in the fish in this Yeah. Oh. Can you keep an eye on it? Does it, it does look like pilchards. That's a cute fire you put together, kids. So, lots happening. Here, making sure no one falls in the moat. And here, making sure no one falls off the chair picker. Ian's been a bit of a star because I did put my back out last week. So, hi Ian. Hi, yeah. Making sure not to get in too close. <laughs> right, we're going in for the cushion shots now, aren't we? Yep. So. Oh, yes, please. You can definitely help. I've, I've missed my helper. I'm just doing my Okay. No, you can keep all that stuff there. Um, yeah. You're tidying it up for me. Thank you. Mm. Right. I think we're doing all right. Firing through. Got our, got our to-do lists. So much going on. Hold on. My husband's, my husband's in here. It's very, very hot. And hold on. You're off into the booth, aren't you, Mr. Shaw? Who's that? Huh? It's it's everyone. Hello. Everyone oh, sorry. I, 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 you're just coming in, pointing a camera at me. Hello. I'm about to get in here and be busy. I, I, I thought it was my mum. Sorry. Right. Do you want me to close the door? Yes, please, darling. Speak to you later. Oh, love you. I'll be very quiet now, although you don't need it because you've got a recording booth. Hello, my Lego master. You're being very, very well behaved, aren't you? Yeah. Mm. What are you making? Well, you know the Lego suit I built? Yeah. Well, he has a younger brother, a hammer fist, and I'm making it. <gasps> Very good. So the Potagerie Suite bathroom has been. Oh, Dorothy, you've run off. Has been taken over. These are these are doorstops. They obviously are an item that is going to be on sale. It's Ian, our cameraman stuff. Oh, hello. Hi. There's a young lady over there, looking very angelic. What are you doing? I'm playing my game. Are you playing a game? Are you? Every part of the house has something happening. Oh, it's just like stuff galore. Stuff, stuff, stuff galore. And Ian, don't get too close to him. But, hello. Ian, you're normally here doing weddings, aren't you, sweetheart? Yeah. yeah. And we are, we are doing the photo shoot, the honeycomb bedding. Lovely flowers from the garden. And yeah, it's definitely, 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 definitely busy compared to normal life. Now these are all handmade in, in the UK. And the honeymoon suite 
Dorothy, you're quite excited. You want to sleep on here tonight, don't you? I do. <laughs> oh, that lighting's nice. Yeah. I have to take a picture of it. Ah, oh, what's very interesting is how bright that chair looks. This is a little exclusive for Sainsbury's. For our Sainsbury's and Argos. Now, this room is the botanical suite back room. It's a room that kind of gets a little bit of overlooked, as it were, but... I have to say, the light in this room that is so bright and beautiful in the morning, Ian's got his uh, filter on there, but I kind of love this wall because it's like the lime plaster, but with sort of this luster teal on it. It's very nice. Going to eventually have all of this wall covered in old sort of botanical prints, but just as and when I find them, I'll put them up. And then through there, oh, with my trusty hoover, is the front bed at Nicole. How's that looking? Good? It will do, yeah. Let's just start this. Mm. Love this. We've got the little butterfly. Oh, honeybee which you've had so many of and something that has been oh absolutely incredible this year it's a hummingbird moth we have had trillions of them especially outside my mum and dad's place we put the writing on because in sort of like a lot of the victoria victorian botanical prints that they have Always, you know, a little writing, descriptive writing, just saying what it is, and a little bit of italic. And that was all the inspiration behind it. Da da da. Oh, look, that's a rose emperor Napoleon. Nice. Beautiful. Love that artistry. Okay, good. A bit of an insight into why I do certain things. <laughs> 